All right. Today I'm going to be working on a 2015 Chevrolet Cruze. Got a bad turbo over there. Shaft broke. Right there. You can see that. And it ended up dumping oil into the exhaust afterwards. So I put it in a drain pan. Trying to get oil out of it. It really is not effective. It's kind of cold outside, so what I'm gonna show you today is how to clean it up. It only cost about 20 bucks to do so. And I think it's gonna be very effective. So this is just to get the oil out. This isn't trying to rejuvenate the catalytic converter or uh, make the substrate come back or anything like that. So uh, give me a minute and I'll get the rest of the stuff I'm going to use and be back with you. Alright, so back at it. Keeping it pretty basic, pretty simple. What I have here is just a simple 5 gallon bucket from Harbor Freight. And it's like an 11 dollar $12 fluid pump that they sell there as well. Takes two D batteries. I mean it... 15 20 bucks for everything it's not really that bad so I took and I added approximately three and a half to four gallons of really just straight hot water and about a half a cup of Dawn dish soap into this what I'm gonna do now sorry this is a uh, probably kind of shaky but what I'm gonna do is take the cap, set it down into that bucket, <clears throat> and I'm leaving the O2 sensor on too. I shouldn't affect it. So set this down in here, like so. And I'm gonna let this run for a couple of hours. Or until the batteries run out, whichever happens first. I don't care either way. I'll just put the pump in into the solution, put the hose into the cap, get it tucked down in there so it doesn't pop out, and then turn it on and let it work its magic for a while. These, uh, these cats are pretty spendy. And they're CARB certified, so they're kind of expensive to replace. And if all you have is an oil leak problem from a turbo or whatnot, just to get the oil out, this is probably one of the best routes to go, in my opinion. I've only had to do it one other time before with a different car, and it, it worked out well, and I never had a problem with the cat. So, uh... As far as final product goes, I'm not. I'm probably not going to come back and show final product because all I'm doing is getting oil out of a tremendous amount of oil out from the catalytic converter. So this is just a quick, simple, easy way. If you want to give it a shot, after I'm done, I'm just going to rinse it out with water, garden hose, and let it dry out. I'll probably use a. Uh, or not use, but I'm probably just going to let it air dry since I have plenty of time. Because I still have to pull the cooler out. The intercooler for the turbo and clean that. Which is going to be a different process and I'll do another video on that when I'm done. So, I hope this helps. This is just for oil removal. And I hope you don't have to do this, but if you do, there you go. Pretty simple, cheap, easy. Alright guys, take care.